This is one of the two locations of Boston Market. This one is located in the Richfield Shopping Center. This one is now closed. Looks like after their little issue with not paying their employees, they don't have any cash left to run the business. So, well, I'm gonna check on the other stores and see if they're closed as well. So the Boston Market here is closed and they've actually had a notice put on their door that they are basically evicted from the property by their landlord. So you will not be seeing this. Boston Market much longer. Now this Boston Market is in Emerson on Kindrickamack Road right on the corner. So say goodbye to this one. Let's go check out those other ones. So this is the 395 Route 17 Mawa Boston Market. And I, I don't have great feelings about this one. Because if you look on the side, I mean, well, you'll see. Let's go through the drive-thru. Let's walk through the drive-thru. Oh, a padlock on the door. That's not a good sign. Yeah, that wouldn't have had a time. Nothing going on in there. Dumpster's full. The sign is still lit up. That's, that's weird. Oh look, they have Perry Perry now. It's interesting because we just started getting a couple Perry Perry restaurant locations. Mm. Outside is not horribly maintained. I love when people put cardboard in the, box, the bin without crushing it. The reason I say I don't have faith in this one opening is because it looks like they started taking things apart inside. Show this wood here. I mean, it's not that much. So yeah, it's very clean. Oh, this? Eh, eh. I'll say... I don't know. I'm going to say I really... This one throws me. I'd say 75% is probably closed because I don't think they're recovering. But if one survives, this is a possibility. Honestly, it's not a great location. I mean, you could easily miss this exit. Yeah, let's do somewhere else. So, we'll see if Mawa opens again, but I wouldn't put money on it. Next stop. This is the Boston Market in Clifton on Route 46. This one has given up. I think this was the first one to give up. Posters falling down. Weeds higher than Snoop Dogg's backyard, I think. I mean, this one, we had been to this one, and this one always had a really bad bathroom. So I'm not that surprised. <laughs> but the service here was really good. There was like one lady that was always working here, and she was really good at maintaining the place, and well, she could maintain. Old bottle of sanitizer. That's like three hundred dollars two years ago. And now all the Boston Market cameras are going crazy. Who is this guy? We keep seeing him everywhere. Mm. 
That's funny, they just paved the road behind it too. Which would be nice. Why is that still going off? They never got the oh they did get the digital board. Just now just three TVs. Uh, what they were doing here, look, dug it all up. They don't even have the dumpster anymore. See, that's always a bad sign. I think there's any pennies at the drive thru. They usually change by the drive thru's. Taco Bell always has a ton. Happy holidays. Oh, they're a little out of date, huh? Boom. They got cups. They got no napkins. They got no straws. Of course, the jersey got rid of straws, didn't they? Yep. Now, this, before this, was, I want to say, a Roy Rogers. And way before that, it was a Geno's. If anybody remembers Geno's. That's what used to be here. So the question will become, is this going to turn into another fast food place or not? On this side of the highway, all the way from, wow, Elmwood Park, somewhere over there, there's nothing. I think Elmwood Park Wendy's would be the first one you'd find of a fast food place. Then you hit this, and only recently they added a Popeyes down on what the name of the road but quite a best buy over there by barnes and noble after that you got no fast food except if you want to consider like jersey mike's in the strip mall up there fast food so this was always to me a good location because if somebody's on their way home this is where you want to go somebody quick and they had a drive through so i think that that might be my last Boston Market I might check. If not, we might add one more. We'll see. Flag's still flying. Man, that is in terrible shape. You should replace that. <sighs> yeah, we'll see. Well, I don't, this one is not opening. I'll, I'll, I'll say 100%, this is not reopening again. Yeah. Uh, yeah. A lot of places closing. Yeah. On to the next one, or not. Or on to that inning. Here's Joy Ride out. Okay, so we're at 20 Wyckoff Ave at this Boston Market. And we'll open soon. A little happy face on the door. Uh, I, don't, I, don't, I don't think so, guys. I don't think so. See what the front looks like. Never been to this one before. This is a new one for us. We will open soon. Yeah, you know, they are being optimistic, aren't they? Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe this one will open. Who knows? Hi! All the sodas on the machines in the back, see that? Hmm. Maybe this one will survive. Can't go around that way. At least this one's still maintained. So let's put a little question mark on this one. Will this one remain when the others close down. I don't know. Hmm. Not nah, there's a lot of soda going to waste there. Are we saying goodbye to this one? Or is this one staying open? Who knows? On to the next one. As you can see, we can't railroad tracks are in front of us. This is where the other 
Boston Market is located, which I never thought was a really good placement for anything. Your destination is on the right. This one is interesting. Okay, this Boston Market's actually open. Wow. I did not realize this one was still open. Maybe you just heard that. That was the train going by. So this Boston Market on Broadway, right under the train tracks, is still open. Might be the only one. I don't see any other open right now. That one had a happy face sign and said they will be opening again, so maybe that one will open. Right now, this is the only Boston Market that is actually open in Fairlawn. So if you're looking for a Boston Market, this in the Fairlawn is the only one that I know of that is open right now. So, Jersey Drive right up. Even the door is open. I mean, it's open, open. But O-P-E-N, open.